This is the 2007 Canada Winter Games on APTN. Athletes kick off the games in grand style. And good evening and welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Whitehorse, the capital city of the Yukon, the host of the 2007 Games. Now, this year's event is historic for many, many reasons. It's the 40th anniversary of the Games since they started back in 1967 in Quebec City. Now, this is the first time in that history that they've ever been held north of 60. And traditional Inuit and Dene Games have been added for that reason, which is another first. And last but not least, we here at APTN are making some big history of our own by covering these Games. Over the next two weeks, we'll bring you 26 hours of nightly coverage live from Whitehorse. Now these uh, games feature 22 events from alpine skiing to wheelchair basketball at 10 venues across the capital city. Now every major sporting event of course begins with opening ceremonies and at the games uh, last night we saw a feast of bright northern lights. The Atco Center was the place to be last night as thousands of athletes, coaches and team staff gathered to celebrate the opening of the 2000 Canada, 2007 Canada Winter Games. For these young people, this is their reward for the hundreds upon hundreds of hours they've dedicated to their sport. And it's an exciting time. For many, the first time they've competed nationally at this elite level. Now there are plenty of dignitaries on hand to help honor athletic achievement, including Prime Minister Stephen Harper, as you just saw. We now light the flame of the 2007 Canada Winter Games. <laughs> 